The Buffalo Ranch Tenders at Popeyes. What's up YouTube? Sweatpants Joe here and it's time for another fun food review. Today I'm checking out the Buffalo Ranch Tenders at Popeyes. They just came out this week. They smell really good. They look good. Here's a shot of the tenders. Now right off the bat, I gotta say, I've never had Popeye's tenders before. I always get the blackened tenders. I never get the regular tenders. These tenders are pretty big, as far as the size goes. I would like it if there was a little more of that buffalo sauce on them, but I don't know how spicy it is. Maybe a little will go a long way. Let's see. Here we go. First bite of the Buffalo Ranch tenders at Popeye's. That bite got a whole lot of crisp, not a lot of sauce. Let me get another bite in. But I'm about to bite right into the middle where all the sauce is kind of collected. This ought to be a really saucy bite. Now that is definitely an interesting sauce. It's an interesting take on buffalo hot sauce. You have the spiciness and the heat of the buffalo sauce, but yet the thickness and the coolness of the ranch sauce. And it kind of mixes together. Now I know a lot of people dip their wings in ranch already. This is kind of like a hybrid of both flavors. You're getting the best of both worlds with this sauce. Now me, you know, I, I grew up in Buffalo. I'm a traditionalist. I'm more of the buffalo wing sauce kind of guy. That being said, this is a very good sauce. And uh, I hope Popeyes keeps this on the menu or at least offers it as a dipping sauce to choose from later on because it's really good. Now, if you've had the tenders at Popeyes before, I don't think these are any different than the normal tenders. They're just throwing the sauce on them. This is more or less a condiment review. Normally I don't do these condiment reviews, but, but I love that chicken at Popeye's. So I definitely wanted to go check this out and I'm glad I did because this is really good. Now, normally when I go to Popeye's, I get the coleslaw as my side dish. Today I got the fries. I was actually tipped off by my good friend, John Splett from the Easy Napkins podcast. You've seen him on this show before. But he said Popeye's, Popeye's fries are legit. I'm gonna try the fries. This is my first time ever having the fries at Popeye's. So these two people have decided they're just gonna stand right behind my car and talk. They're just gonna have a full on conversation at my car. Great. Now I gotta wait for these bozos to shut up. Here we go, some more fries. The fries have some seasoning to them. They're a little thicker, which I like, but they don't blow me away. They're not terrible, but next time I'm gonna go back with the coleslaw. Now I'm gonna rate everything on a scale of PU it stinks to sunshine, lollipops, and rainbows. I am giving the Buffalo Ranch Chicken Tenders at Popeyes a solid I like it. They're very good. Like I said before, if you've had the tenders before, these don't reinvent the wheel. They just added a really good sauce, and I'm glad I ordered it. Let me know in the comments below if you've tried these and what you thought. Also, let me know what dipping sauce you got. They just gave me their regular ranch, their buttermilk ranch, and it'll probably be really good. Actually, I'll try that now. They just gave me their regular buttermilk ranch sauce, and I'll try it with that. I'm sure it's really good. But let me know in the comments below if you've had it with another sauce, maybe the sweet heat, maybe the blackened ranch. I don't know. Should I have gone differently with the dipping sauce? Let me know. That's a whole lot of ranch on ranch right there. That's a lot of ranch. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time.